Hello, winning women. It is Letitia. So, okay, I'm going to tell you real fast what um, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday outfits were. So, Thursday, I wore a dress. Like, it was like an autumn-looking dress. It looked like I was a spokesperson for autumn. Spokesperson for fall, um, whichever one you call it. I say autumn. Excuse me. Anyways, so I wore that with the white um, crochet jacket over it. And I put the jacket on because although the dress is really, really pretty by itself, it shows a lot of boobage. So it's like a wrap top and, and, um, it was like super open, so all of this would have been open. Then I had on some over the knee boots with it and some tights, and I felt pretty. And I was definitely winning with that one. Super, super winning with that one. I liked it and I felt good about myself. And we went to Nomads, so I had that on while we were at Nomads, and I didn't feel like I was gonna flash somebody's kid or that the dress was too short or anything like that. So I felt like it was a good choice and apparel for a Thursday. And then for Friday, Friday was okay. Um, I've, I could have done better with Friday. I had on a pair of jeans and some um, thigh-high um, boots. They had a heel to it. The other boots that I had on that were over the knee, they did not have a heel. They were flats. Um, I had on a sweater. I love that sweater. It's so fuzzy and cozy. I love that sweater. But the sweater was super perfect, but the jeans were super tight. The sweater didn't cover, um, it wasn't as much coverage as it could have been with those jeans on. If I had on like some sweats that were a little bit looser, then that would have been fine, but the pants were very snug. So um, I probably have to invest in some new jeans because all my jeans are hugging me like we we haven't seen each other in millions of years you know like they was like Tisha Tisha where you been and they was hugging me so tight <laughs> and my thighs and behind is embracing them back like yes we miss you too so it was a love fest going on on the bottom parts of me um and I love over the knees or thigh high boots I love them so the boots were to me okay, but again with super tight pants, shouldn't I shouldn't even have done that. But I felt cute. I looked cute, but I did not look modest at all. The top could have been, or if I would have worn it with a skirt with the with the um thigh high boots, that would have been fine too, because nobody would have known, you know, what was really going on as far as what I have to offer in my lower extremities. And then on Saturday, we had a great day on Saturday. Me and the kids, I told you guys we had a lot of things planned for that day. And we got all of it done and some. And I had my niece with me, which was awesome. She was a cool kid. Um, shout out to Leah. Anyways, I had on the cart, you know, my long burgundy cardigan that I love so much. I had to buy some, like, I got to invest in some rock, some dusters and some long cardigans too so that I can wear different colors because your girl been playing that one out. And I still love it. So like all my clothes, I'm just going to keep wearing it out until it falls apart. Anyways, I had that on with a, um, a colorful shirt. I love colors just because I'm trying to be modest does not mean I'm not going to stick to my colors. I love colors, bright, busty colors, like boom, I love them. Um, so I had on a bright, it was like orange, yellow, pink, red, all those kinds of colors inside of that. Um, and I had on some jeggings. And honestly, my jeggings were were looser than all my other jeans. It's like, what is going on? So they were looser, so I didn't feel like I was doing anything wrong with those on. And I had on my black, um, my black, they just mid-calf regular boots, flat boots that I had on. I love those because they are like the staple of my shoe collection right now. They go with everything and anything, and I can do it However, I can dress it up or dress it down. So you will see those a lot until I find some other ones that I like just as much as those. And they're black. So when? And that was it for 
Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. I had a wonderful weekend and I'm about to go into having a wonderful week. You guys get winning. I hope that you are prepared for the week as to what you're going to wear. Um, if you are not, and if you are, good luck. <laughs> God bless you with the week. Be productive, be peaceful, and be positive. Remember that modesty is the best policy and everybody needs some, you know, leave something for the imagination with what you're wearing. Have a great week, you guys. Peace out, Winnie women.